here's what I've discovered and here's what the book, The Attractor Factor, explains. Unless your beliefs are congruent with your attempts to have success, you may sabotage your own efforts. You won't do it consciously. You won't do it willingly. But for example, if you're trying to earn more money, unconsciously you think money's bad, or you think money's evil, or you think money corrupts, those beliefs around money will stop you from bringing in more money. You'll bring in only so much because consciously you're wanting it. And part of the big message of my career, as well as that book, The Attractor Factor, is you have to get clear of the negative beliefs within you in order for you to have the success you desire. If somebody says that they want their business to explode and they have no counter beliefs within them, they can make their business explode. If somebody says, I want my business to improve, but they have doubts about deserving this, they have doubts about their business, they can block unconsciously their own success. And this is really, really important because to me, I can teach people how to create publicity releases or a publicity event or write ads or write copy or write books. But if they don't have the internal in alignment first, then everything I teach them, they will find a way to abort. They'll find a way to make it not work because unconsciously they haven't been in alignment with it. That's what the attractor factor is about.